Hi, my name is Susan Barnett. I'm an attorney at Heyman Hoke. Today, I want to talk to you about guardianship. Guardianship is the process by which one person gets the legal authority to make financial, legal, and or medical decisions for someone who is incapacitated. Guardianship is a very expensive process, and I'm not just talking about financial expense. There is most definitely a financial cost to it. A guardianship requires at least two attorneys to be involved the one who files the application for guardianship and represents the applicant or the proposed guardian, and then an attorney that is appointed by the court to represent the proposed ward, the incapacitated person. So at a minimum, you've got the expense of two attorneys. On top of that, if there is an estate to manage, then there is an ongoing expense of preparing an annual accounting, and it has to be done by an attorney. In addition to the expense, the court oversees the management of the estate, meaning the guardian has to have court permission for everything he or she needs to spend for the ward, and that goes on for the rest of the ward's life, or until the guardianship is no longer needed. But aside from the financial cost and the legal burdens, there's also an emotional cost, and that's what gets to me. Guardianship is heart-wrenching. Imagine taking someone you love to the courtroom and having the judge declare them incapacitated. It's a very difficult emotional process. I've seen entire families reduced to tears over it. The good news is, with the proper estate plan, you can avoid guardianship over your finances and often over your medical decisions. If you have a loved one who is no longer able to make de decisions for themselves, we can help with that. But better yet, if you or someone you love wants to avoid this process in the future, give us a call. We can help with that too.